Good morning, my dear fellows. I'm Rana Sedri, lecturer of operative dentistry at Ain Shams University, Cairo, Egypt. My project is entitled An Online Flipped Classroom Model for the Preclinical Practical Course in Operative Dentistry. What it implies my, pro my project is about curating an online uh, uh, demonstrations uh, that are fully uh, narrated and fully illustrated for students to have beforehand so that they can watch unlimitedly and come to the lab already prepared to practice their skill. The project is implemented in three phases, the initiation phase, and then the implementation phase and the closure phase. For the initiation phase, which uh, uh, involves the, taking the necessary approvals, uh, creating the project team, and then creating the material that will be uploaded uh, on the LMS. Um, and then the, the, the content will, will be reviewed by uh, the department council after taking their approval. We'll, uh, the, we started the second phase, phase, which is the implementation phase, in which we uploaded this uh, content into the LMS to be available for students. Uh, and we included with it uh, some quizzes so that we make sure that the students uh, view the videos. Uh, and uh, afterwards, we, ha we, uh, we will start the third phase, which is the, uh, which is the closure phase, in which we uh, collect the data from students and from the staff uh, uh, in the form of feedback. And then we also collect data from the LMS uh, for, uh, for the number of views of the videos and the number of logins. And then uh, we'll t after gathering this data, the data will be analyzed. And then uh, we will uh, see if the project or this way of teaching have improved the outcome for students. And we will come up also with an improvement plan for the project. Uh, so far, we've, uh, we've reached the second and the third milestone in this project, and we already have some uh, uh, improvement uh, plan and that will be implemented uh, with the next year students, inshallah. So far, the lessons learned in, in uh, this project that I have uh, to involve the, the stakeholders as early as possible in the process in order for them to be on the same page and to avoid misunderstanding and double work. That's especially with, with my uh, colleagues in the department. The second one is also uh, uh, related to the stakeholders, but in this time with the students. Uh, I, I uh, have to make sure that the students have the whole project plan clear to them for early in the beginning of the year so that they know that the, uh, the the LMS content and the recorded field use is the, or the only portal for uh, demonstrations and that the, the this is um, the, you have to take it seriously and they have to uh, come prepared so that they don't uh, miss uh, practicing their skills. So for the changes made to the project is that uh, we think that it, it is uh, mandatory or it, and, and beneficial to include the preclinical preparatory course of the fourth year students, which is a very small preclinical uh, uh, extension of the preclinical course that they take in the beginning of the fourth year before they start uh, practicing uh, clinically on patients. So I think having this also online uh, will be uh, will speed up the process and will uh, will help them to the to uh, acquire the required skill uh, more quickly. Also, we have made some uh, changes to the settings of the quizzes required after watching the demonstrations. Thank you so much for.